These guys just don't know when to bloody give up, do they? Can't believe they just slapped her in the face. The only thing on her that needs slapping is those two fucking twin cheeks on her ear. Leave her face be. God, they're getting away. Being the brave bugger that I am, I had to get up there somehow. And there weren't very many options. Whoop. Jump! Bloody eventful with you guys, let me tell you. Certainly not boring evenings. Let's take these buggers out. Run, girl, run! I deserve death for that shirt alone. Stop, leave her alone. I won't be dealing with it. A life saved. And only 40 taken. A good day's work. Bloody hell. Didn't think I'd find myself in this position. A moment of pause and peace. I knew we were safe, but the girl, one of them was gone. The other one was somewhere, but I didn't know where, and I was the only one around to find her. So off I ventured. Gun in one hand, cock in the other. Bloody hell, I was ready. Case was on. There's only one way I knew how to do things. 
the fucking cool way. Here we bloody go. Don't like my music? You'll like my fucking lead in your mouth. They have a regular army up here, don't they, eh? Any more of you? Didn't bloody think so. I could smell you though, I know there's some more around here somewhere. Oh, hello! I was lucky their aim was absolute bollocks. Push yourself forward, Maxi. Stay strong for the girl. Oh dear, how many are there? Oh, right on his eyeballs. Not pleasant. It's her necklace. She's come this way. Over here. Oh, there she is. It's all right, love. It's all right. You're safe now. I don't know where they've taken your sister. But you're in the safe, warm arms of old Maxie. Look at that, lovers reunited. Is there anything else that warms your cockles so much? I don't think so. Here I was back at home, alone, me only pals. Prescription drugs in the bottle. I tell you, I was low as a fucking badger. And only fractionally as hairy. Even glasses couldn't bear my touch. But we had a problem. This family had witnessed my skills at their party and brought me on board. One of the girls was still kidnapped and we needed to find her. The only way we knew how, or the only way rich people know anyway, is to pay a ransom. The ransom was demanded. A massive blue bag of jelly beans. Why they wanted these, I've no idea. You could get this in any shop relatively cheaply. That's what they wanted. Thought they were having a laugh, but that's what we brought to the stadium to meet up. But things were not going to go to plan. 
I was shot to fuck because some dirty bag had a bloody sniper rifle somewhere. I stumbled my way forward trying to get out of danger. I'll tell you what, I was buggered. I was buggered in the arse, I could tell you. I was buggered. I was bleeding out fast. My vision was all over the place. I struggled through. All the jock straps everywhere. It was bloody smell awful. Filthy laundry. Oh God. What we have there? Back in jacuzzi. Probably filled with all manner of fecal matter and piss. Oh. I don't know why these thoughts were coming to me at this point, but they were. I pushed on for poorly. I knew he'd get me through. Holy! Oh! Now, Polly's all right. <laughs> Finally, right. bit of medication. Holy looked after me good. Straight and narrow, that fella. Now I was back in the game. Fast and loose. Especially my butt cheeks. Come in. Luck flies into a spider web. Boom! In a cheek. Take these stupid balls. No time for a can of refreshing beverage either. I had to push on. Oh, shotgun. Lovely. Just step up in it. Let's see if this thing works. 